Hello everyone, so in this video I'll show you how to uh, remove the MIPI cable of your wok snail cam. So in this case, this is the wok snail avatar HD Pro kit camera. So first is you have to remove four screws here, Phillips screws. The very, it's a very small one, but we just need to remove the back cover so that we are able to see the MIPI cable at the back of this so just gently remove four of these screws. Be very careful when doing this because you might damage your MIPI cable and as we all know, they are very, very sensitive. So just remove this very gently here until you're able to access the back part of this cam. Okay. So we are now able to see it. I do apologize if it's not that clear. <laughs> this is a bit okay. So this is the MIPI cable. It's a bit difficult to remove, but as you can see here, you can actually just uh, peel it off, but you'll be able to see some lines here hope you can see it, I'll just try to zoom it in to make it easier to see okay let's try to focus on that part as you can see here there are three lines that uh, that, uh, no, actually two lines that is holding the MIPI cable at the middle. So the way to remove it is to pry off the black part here or you can actually go for the left side because there are no capacitor here. So let's just pry it off. Okay. And once it is removed can actually take off the other part so gently do this because you might damage the very very small pins it's really small and this is how it looks like on the other part this is the pin okay so that's how you remove this now if you want to put it back in same procedure just align this on the middle of these two lines as you can see here there are two lines this is the first one and this is the sec the, th the third one okay just align it again in the middle same procedure just held it by force just a bit then press it again it will clip onto this two lines here and uh, you're good to go okay so we will be using this on, an, on a separate uh, item which is the fly will far fly so that would be our next video wherein we will put this here on our fly will far fly but for now I just showed you how to remove it so that it would be easy for you to replace or to move your camera from one walks new VTX to another so that is how you do it